So, here's the situation with Iran. They are enriching uranium, which could be used for mainly two purposes. It can either be used to build nuclear power plants, or it could be used to build nuclear weapons. Iran, of course, claims they just want power plants, but we know that they also want weapons. After careful consideration, I have concluded that there's only really four ways this could possibly work out. Currently, we're using sanctions in the hopes of stopping them, but that will only delay them, as we saw with North Korea. For those of you who don't know, sanctions are essentially restrictions on trade. We hope that the international community will cooperate with us and block Iran from trading for anything they could use to build a nuclear warhead. That's only buying us time, which brings me to the four possibilities. Two of these possibilities result in a nuclear Iran, and two of them don't. Let me start with the two that do. Number one, we simply keep doing what we're doing. We continue the sanctions. We continue to anger the government of Iran. They find ways to get the materials they need. It would very likely come from Russia. And as a result, they eventually get a nuclear warhead. Possibility number two. We make an agreement with Iran, but it's a very weak agreement. It doesn't do enough to keep them from getting the materials they need, and they get a nuclear warhead. This could also happen if we make an agreement and just don't enforce it properly. So, now for the possibilities of stopping them from becoming a nuclear power. Number one, brute force. We go to war with them. Let me make this very clear. We are not going to use military force to stop them from getting a nuclear warhead without a full-scale war. If we just use airstrikes as powerful and united as Iran is and as it would be if we attacked them, they would likely attack our allies and we would have to go to war. So, one way to stop them is a full-scale war. We could win. I'm almost certain we would but it would be very costly, probably a lot more than Iraq was, because unlike Iraq, where we had different factions we could play against each other, we don't have that luxury in Iran. Which brings me to possibility number four. We work out an agreement with Iran, and we actually enforce it properly. This agreement would allow them to enrich uranium just enough to build nuclear power plants, but we closely watch them and we make sure that they do not enrich uranium to the point where they could build a nuclear warhead. If we can work something like that out and enforce it, we could stop them from becoming a nuclear power without going to war. But make no mistake, if your goal is to stop Iran from getting a nuclear warhead, we either make an agreement with them or we go to war. There's no other way. I've thought about this long and hard, and those four possibilities are all I can see. But I certainly don't know everything. And if you can think of some other possibility I hadn't considered, please tell me about it and tell everyone about it in the comment section below. Thank you for tuning in.